Welcome to the Rig Clinic and in today's video I'm going to show you how to tie fluorocarbon leaders. Now I've been using fluorocarbon leaders for quite a few years but one thing I've never been very keen on is just how expensive they are. So I set about finding a more cost effective way of tying up these leaders and that's what I'm going to share with you today. I'll take you through all of the items you need as well as how to tie the leaders themselves. So the items you'll need are some fluorocarbon material, some large tungsten sinkers, some line saver beads, a heli safe, a quick change ring swivel and a 5mm rubber bead. And the tools you'll need are simply a pair of scissors and a puller tool. Firstly, dismantle your heli safe to ensure that you have the outer shell, the top cap, the half swivel, the spring and the inner plastic housing. Take your fluorocarbon and peel off a length whilst leaving it on the spool for now. Slide on a large tungsten sinker, followed by the 5mm rubber bead. Moisten your sinker and slide the rubber bead on top. Next, thread on your quick change ring swivel followed by the line saver bead. Your leader should now start to look something like this. To attach the heli safe, first slide on the top cap, followed by the spring, and then finally the plastic housing. Now take the half swivel and attach it using a four turn grinner knot. Take your time when tying the four turn grinner knot to ensure it's nice and neat, and moisten the knot, then pull it down tightly with the puller tool. Trim off the end tag, and then slide the half swivel into the plastic housing. Finally, attach the outer shell of the heli safe. Slide the line saver bead down to the heli safe and then set the top bead at your preferred distance from the heli safe. Pull off approximately a metre of fluorocarbon material, cut the fluorocarbon, and then finally tie a figure eight loop knot at the top. Trim off the end tag and then steam your leader straight. And there you go guys, that's how you tie your own fluorocarbon leaders. If you've liked this video, please hit the like button below and subscribe to the channel for more content. And if you have any suggestions on any more rigs or tips that you'd like me to explain, then please add them to the comments section below.